I'm going to practice decision making for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you haven't played this version yet, there are links below the video to a lesson playlist so you can learn how to play. It's very challenging and there are even tournaments. If you go to a tournament, a lot of times they have prizes. So for this exercise, I'm going to force hands so that I can practice winning a prize at a tournament. If you have a set at home, give this exercise a try. If you're new to Mahjong or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. Like numbers. Singles and pairs. Addition. Quince. Winds and Dragons, Year. This will be interesting. Hard, hard, sharing tiles, lots of flowers. Here we go. We'll just say that we are player one for these and we'll take 28 random tiles each time. Okay, let's see, what can we leverage for one of these? We have a pair of flowers, whites, eights, two is a pung, pair, pair, four, five, three, four, five. Okay, let's see. What about the news pair hand? News pair hand, eight tiles. Oh, here's seven, eight, nine, just as an option. Let's see. Seven, eight, nine, or three, four, five. Okay, we don't have consecutive run on here. We could have played two, three, four, five, but consecutive run isn't up here. All right, let's see here. What could we do? Year, we gotta make a year work here. Two, zero, one, eight. Two, zero, one, eight. This would be the third hand down. We need a one dot and a flower. 2018 year hand and then down here I think I think what I would do is play a year hand and force a pair hand news consecutive run with either three four five or seven eight nine actually you know what we could do Hold these for joker bait and force this one because there are two pairs there. There was only one pair here. So that's nine discards with joker bait, year and pair hand. Year and pair hand. If you would do something differently here, write force one and what you would have done with these tiles. There's a lot of consecutive run in here, but that's not up for grabs. We want to force hands with these categories. Let's see what we can do next time. Force two, on to force two.
Look at that. That is crazy. Okay, let's see. What can we do here? We have lots of flowers. We should try to make an addition hand work. Seven, five, twelve. Seven, five, twelve. Seven. Let's see. If we did addition and like numbers, we do have lots of sevens. If we did 9, 3, 12 and like numbers, let's see. Okay, there's all the sevens. And then if we did 9, 3, 9, 3, 12, the first addition hand and like numbers with sevens, then we would hold... Joker bait here. Like numbers with sevens. Nine, three, twelve. Discard these first. Hold those for joker bait. Like numbers and addition. For the like numbers, you just hold every seven and dragon. There are three hands you could play. If we got more flowers, we could even potentially use this up here. But I think like numbers with dragons is better, especially if we can leverage some of that joker bait. If you would have done something different here, let me know. We're going to go on to quince and winds and dragons. Okay, we've got some winds and dragons here. I think I would probably try for news with dragons and we have one pair here that we can leverage. And then down here, we would need to try for either three, six, nine, like numbers or consecutive run. So we have two, three, five, six, eight, nine, six, three, six, nine, no multiples in there. I think we would probably need to try around the, the threes. Three, four, five, six, consecutive run. That's a lot of discards. Let's see, one, two, so I would hold this, just hold every wind and dragon. We could do north and south with ones. Maybe north and south with ones. Three. I think this is how I would do it. Winds and dragons, options with like numbers with north and south. Then down here, three, four, five, six consecutive run quint. That would be the last one under quints. These are gonna take a lot of work. If you would do something differently with those, let me know. I would hold these as long as possible to try to get some jokers out of them and just discard these first. Siamese mahjong is hard. Well, especially if you're forcing hands. Oh my gosh, those were terrible. Which is why I think practicing is a good thing. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the bell if you do, so you get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next Siamese Force 
for American style mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. May all your picks be keepers.